वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स सेवेंथ क्लास मैथमेटिक्स एक्सरसाइज 4.1 स्टूडेंट्स इन एक्सरसाइज 4.1 वी हैव सॉल्व फर्स्ट एंड सेकंड मेन क्वेश्चंस कम टू सॉल्व द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री एंड फोर्थ इन द क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री सॉल्व द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चंस बाय ट्रायल एंड एरर मेथड हियर वी हैव टू क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट वन 5p plus 2 is equal to 17 and second one 3m minus 14 is equal to 4 take the first one first question is 5p plus 2 is equal to 17 put p is equal to 1 put p is equal to 1 therefore 5u in place of p put 1 5u into 1 plus 2 is equal to 17 therefore 5 into 1 is 5u plus 2 is equal to 17 5 plus 2 is 7 7 is equal to 17 therefore 1 is not the solution therefore 1 is p is equals to 1 p is equals to 1 is not a solution next put p is equals to 2 therefore 5 into 2 plus 2 is equals to 17 5 to the 10 plus 2 is equals to 17 10 plus 2 is 12 12 is equals to 17 Therefore, P is equal to 12 is not a solution. Now put P is equal to 3. Therefore, <coughs> phi u into bracket P, no, phi u into 3 plus 2 is equal to 17. Take the given equation 5p plus 2 is equal to 17. In place of p, I write 3. 5 into p. 5 into 3 plus 2 is equal to 17. 5 3 is a 15 plus 2 is equal to 17. Therefore, 15 plus 2 is 17. Right hand side is 17. Therefore, left hand side is equal to right hand side. Therefore, P is equal to 3 is a solution of phi u p plus 2 is equal to 17. Second question is 3m minus 14 is equal to 4. Put m is equals to 1 therefore 3 into bracket 1 minus 14 is equals to 4 3 ones are 3 minus 14 is equals to 4 3 minus 14 is minus 11 is equals to 4 lhs is not equal to rhs number b put m is equals to 2 therefore 3 into 2 in place of m put 2 3 into 2 minus 14 is equals to 4 3 to the 6 minus 14 is equals to 4 6 minus 14 is minus 8 that is equals to 4 this is lhs and this is rhs lhs is minus 8 RHS is 4 they are not equal LHS is not equal to RHS therefore next number C put M is equal to 3 therefore 3 into 3 minus 14 3 into 3 minus 14 is equal to 4 3 3 is a 9 9 minus 14 that is equal to 4 9 minus 14 is minus 5 
that is equals to 4 this is LHS this is RHS they are not equal therefore left hand side is not equal to right hand side number D put M is equals to 4 therefore 3 in, in place of M in place of M write 4 3 into 4 minus 14 is equals to 4 3 4 is 12 minus 14 is equals to 4 12 minus 14 is minus 2 that is equals to 4 LHS is minus 2 RHS is 4 they are not equal therefore left hand side is not equal to right hand side next number E put M is equals to 5 therefore in place of M write 5 3 into 5 minus 14 is equal to 4 3 into bracket 5 minus 14 is equals to 4 therefore 3 5 is 15 minus 14 is equals to 4 therefore 15 minus 14 is 1 is equals to 4 left hand side is 1 right hand side is 4 they are not equal therefore left hand side is not equal to right hand side similarly take next number put m is equals to 6 therefore in place of m put 6 3 into bracket 6 minus 14 is equals to 4 therefore 3 6 is 18 18 minus 14 is equals to 4 18 minus 14 is 4 is equals to 4 now LHS and, R and RHS are same therefore left hand side is equals to right hand side therefore m is equals to 1 m is equals to 2 m equals 3 m equals 4 m equals 5 these are not the solution because in each case LHS and RHS are not equal but when we put m is equal to 6 both left hand side and right hand side are equal therefore m is equal to 6 is the solution of the given equation therefore 6 is therefore solution of 3m minus 14 is equal to 4 is 6 therefore solution is 6 next question number 4 write equations for the following statements in the main question number 4 we are given the statements read the statement and then perform the equations first one the sum of numbers x and 4 is 9 that is sum of x plus 4 is 9 so x plus 4 is 9 this is the equation therefore x plus 4 is equals to 9 this is the required equation for this statement next statement 2 subtracted from y is 8 2 subtracted from y this implies that is y minus 2 is equals to 8 this is the equation for this statement third statement 10 times a is 70 10 times a means 10 a therefore 10 a is equals to 70 the statement is 10 times a is 70 the equation is 10 a is equals to 70 next fourth statement the number b divided by 5 gives 6 the number b divided by 5 gives 6 therefore 
the equation for this statement is the number b divided by 5 b divided by 5 gives 6 is equals to 6 this is the equation for this statement next statement number 5 next statement 3 fourth of t is 15 3 fourth of t e that is 3 by 4 of t 3 by 4 t is 15 that is equals to 15 3 by 4 t is equals to 15 this is the statement for this this is the equation for this statement next sixth statement 7 times m plus 7 gets you 77 7 times m is 7 m plus 7 is equals to 77 7 times m is 7 m plus 7 plus 7 gets you is equals to 77 this is the equation for this given statement next statement number 7 one fourth of a number x minus 4 gives 4 one fourth of a number x is x by 4 minus 4 gives 4 is equals to 4 this is the equation for this given statement next statement if you take away 6 from 6 times y you get 60 if you take away 6 from 6 times y take away 6 means minus 6 from 6 times y 6 times y is 6y that is 6y minus 6 you get 60 that is equals to 60 this is the equation for this statement next statement if you add 3 to one third of z you get 30 if you add 3 add 3 means plus 3 to one third of z one third of z is z upon 3 the equation is z by 3 plus 3 you get 30 that is equals to 30 this is the required equation for this given statement next question number 5 write the following equations in statement forms in the question number 5 we are given 8 equations equation 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 first equation is p plus 4 is equals to 15 see how to write this given equation in the statement form sum of t plus 4 is 15 equation is p plus 4 is equal to 15 see how to write this equation in the form of statement p plus 4 means sum of p plus 4 is 15 second one m minus 7 is equal to 3 so this is the given equation this is m minus 7 m minus 7 is equal to 3 now subtracting 7 from m from a number m it gives 3 and this is 7 m is equal to sorry 2 m is equal to 7 product of 2 and m is 7 or you can write this as 2 times m is 7 p plus 4 is equal to 15 this is the given equation its statement is sum of p and 4 is 15 sum of p and 4 is 15 second number m minus 7 is equals to 3 this is the given equation 
we write this equation as 7 is subtracted from m is 3. Seven is subtracted from m is three. Two m is equal to seven. This is equation. Its statement is two times m is seven. Two times m is seven. Next, fourth statement. Fourth equation is m by five u. M divided by five u is equal to three. A number m is divided by 5 is gives 6 sorry a number m is divided by 5 gives 3 number m is divided by 5 gives 3 next equation 3m divided by 5 is equal to 6 3m means 3 times m divided by 5 3 times m 3 times a number m divided by 5 gives 6. 3 times m, 3 times a number m divided by 5 gives 6. Next equation is 3p plus 4 is equal to 25. This is the given equation. 3p means 3 times a number p plus 4 gives 25 3 times a number p plus 4 gives 25 this is the statement of this equation next seventh equation is 4p minus 2 is equal to 18. Its statement is 2 subtracted from 4 times a number p is 18. 2 subtracted from 4 times a number p. 4 times a number p is 18. This is the statement for this equation. Next equation is p by 2 plus 2 is equals to 8. Sum of 2 and p by 2 is 8. Sum of 2 and p by 2 is 8. This is the statement for this equation.